Well, thanks guys for visiting with me today. Yes, of course. Uh, thank you. For thank you for us to your yeah. apartment. This is a great place. This is nice. So and you got uh, a great flat screen. Thanks what? for getting the word out about yeah. this. Thanks for putting up the poster. Yes. Yeah. What can I do? Uh, you're on it. You're on it. Don't Am I on the poster? It. You are on the poster. He has not let me see I will not love because I don't want you to, you know, but you are on it. Uh, uh, yeah, uh, hey. uh, he won't let me see it. You're on it. Dude. Am I on the poster? Yes. As long as I'm on there. Thank you. you. Just don't turn around. I won't. Uh, guys. Right, you're only one on the poster. Right. That's all you need to know. Great. Speaking of riffing, uh, what makes a good improv partner? Oh. Trust. 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 Um, Alcohol. Familiarity. Familiarity. Just a, a, a basic, uh, really openness. Because, you know, even if you just meet somebody and y'all need to improv, you know, you, it has to be an openness, a playfulness, like you children on a playground and, hey, you want to play? Yeah. And then you assume you two are going to play together and it's going to be fair and da 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 So I think an openness and, uh, you know, a, a, a basic trust. Give and take. Give and take. A back and forth. Be a good listener, right? <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, awesome. you What's he like as a producer? Um, uh, now keep in mind. Yeah, yeah. He was uh, one of yeah, the executive you. producers of the movie. And so um, the absolutely. I want to say that it was a real joy to work with Craig as a producer on the movie. I certainly know that Craig was the one that hired me. Greg was the one that signed my paychecks. I had a great time on this film. It was a joy to be there. I got to work on time every day. I memorized my lines, and at the end of the shoot, I bought everyone a gift. Thank you for having me. You're very welcome. Well done. Um, I was curious also what you guys think. Um, you know, End of the World, uh, for me, I know there's a lot of movies that, that can explore that kind of idea, but what do you think it is about it that's so right for comedy? Well, I'll throw the caution to the wind. Your it, it yeah. plays on your imagination. I mean, everybody has an opinion on, on what the end of the world would be like, and you know, and it's, it also has these all these human elements of fear and uh, 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 what what you would do in that situation. You know, so it, it's it's ripe for somebody to come in and go, okay, well, this is what we would do, and you know, and it's, it, we got plenty of serious movies about it. Here's somebody going, okay, check this out. This is what it's like two years into the rapture. That's what I. That's exactly what I was gonna say. Shut up! <laughs> he is the boss. Yeah, man. Yeah, you know your role. Um, speaking of which, what was it like playing the beast? Did you have fun finding your inner beast. <sighs> Had a ball finding my inner beast. He just um, finding this character and uh, and and figuring out what his insecurities were and and why and why he uh, thought you were thirsty. Why he um, decided to you know call himself the Antichrist and you know the things that he's done he he you know to take over the world it was to just it was just fun to to know that he, he could at any time snap his fingers and have whatever he wanted and I mean who hasn't at one time or another thought about doing that he's got all kinds of powers you know he can do anything he wants um, he can have anything he wants ah! oh! So yeah, I felt like he was, you know, he 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 could just go anywhere he wanted. Yeah. So it was it was a fun to mine that and mix that salad up of everything and just play with it. Well, okay, I was gonna ask you about being producer. Like, what does the story have to say to you to put your name on it? Because I know it's a little bit extra work. Hey, hey! You know what? There were so many <laughs> characters that it was gonna be fun to plug in, um, and you know, you get your friends work and. And and make this these words come to life. Uh, it, it's it's got to be something that you know that makes me laugh, you know as, as well. It's, so it was those kind of elements went in. You know something I could be proud of and and uh, you know have a vision for. And you can get your song in there. I wanna touch a Buddha. Hey, oh, hey girl. I wanna touch a Buddha. It's me. Bring that booty over here. I wanna touch your booty. Now, girl. All night long. Right now. I wanna touch your booty. Did you hear me, girl? All night long. I don't see no booty. <laughs> I wanna touch your booty. <laughs>